We were given a kind of brief which was uh, more the Queen's personal life and that's um, from that we came up with the idea of the Queen's favourites. Um, obviously we have to pass things through the Royal Household so there has been and we've also been looking at bringing humour to that section and um, there has been a couple of things that we have had to change slightly let's say um, uh, but on the whole we've been able to be quite free in terms of creatively. It's an event that happens uh, on the Thames and they count the swans to check how they're surviving, you know, and it's quite comical. It, it, there is ceremony to it, there's dignity to it and there's history to it, but it's also quite funny and I wanted to show that and I hope we have, yeah. This one. Oh, yeah. Is that Susan there? Yeah. <laughs> That's lovely. Corgis have different um, characters and I've done this by making them have different ears, uh, different markings, they've got different coloured eyes and also different um, tongs as well. So some are sticking out and some are, are a little bit shorter. Yeah, I've been working on them since January uh, with prototypes and working out how they can move um, in, a, in a fun and quirky way. Um, the original idea was that uh, they are um, one of the Queen's favourites, uh, her corgis, and that they are mischievous and up to all sorts of naughtiness during the procession. I wanted to um, obviously show each horse's individuality, but I also wanted to um, show the sculptures that you see in the street, the equine sculptures, and usually they're in stone or marble. And so that's what I wanted the base to be. But then I wanted it to sort of move into the materials of the Midlands, because this is where the cogs and the wheels and the industry of the Midlands. And so that's why the top half of the horse is like that. And that also helps with the movement of the legs of the horse, the cogs and the wheels. <laughs> I think it's wonderful. It's a tribute to her. It's a tribute to the makers and the designers of 
up the country. And I think it's something we need after the last two years. Something to give us some joy. Yeah. It's the wind, I can't. It's the wind. It's the wind. It's the wind. It's the wind. I can get both of them to sort of do it. Just bring them more to a point. Oh, hello. Oh, it's my own. <laughs>